Mayor Cobblepot? Hello, Isabella. May I? Um, of course. Going somewhere? Just for a couple nights, but I was hoping to talk to Ed before I left. Um, try calling him, is he okay? <laughs> yes. How shall I put this? It's over. Excuse me? He is not going to see you anymore. Do not try to contact him. That door is closed. Have a nice life. Oh my. It is a shock. But besides your odd resemblance to his ex, a certain facility with riddles, Compulsion for order. What is it that you two really have in common? Edward is a person of exceptional intelligence and imagination. He deserves to be appreciated by someone on his own level. And you, my dear, are simply not. Best to end things now. You're right. I don't deserve it. Glad we agree. Bye. But I'm not gonna let him go. He loves me, and I love him. Do you know how rare that is, Mr. Mayor? Of course you do. Because you love him too. I can see it. I'm not even jealous. I don't think that you understand. It's my glasses this morning. They reminded him of Miss Kringle. He's afraid he's going to hurt me like he hurt her. Listen to me, you little idiot. I am telling you one last time. Let Ed go. No. I will write to him. I will make him understand. He has nothing to fear. I'm not going to let him go. Very well. Don't say I didn't warn you. <laughs>